everyone, welcome back to another video. Um, today, I've alluded to this for such a long time, I got to film two unboxing videos today. We got the Top Picks American Nightmare Cody Rhodes figure, and we've got the ringside exclusive Tommaso Ciampa. But, you know, I got, this is for this bad boy right here. Um, it's just a repaint of the Elite 101, and it's an inaccurate repaint, of course. That was one of the biggest controversies with this figure, but... I felt that it was a little flimsy. I was hoping I didn't have to use any scissors for this. There we go. Oh, they're on the other side. How am I not getting it? It's right there. Oh, I did turn it. Stupid me. As Kyle Peterson would say. As Kyle Peterson would say, see you later. Goodbye. Now we have Cody. Right here. Uh, wait, bro. Oh, no. Boop. Okay, and I'll get Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Come on, Mike. Holy hand, you're my favorite. Go. See you later. Goodbye. Okay. So, um, the figure, I mean, it feels the exact same as the Elite 101. And I mean, that, that is a good thing. Focus camera, geez. That is a good thing. Um, has the stupid tattoo on the side. But I'm, I, oof, uh-oh. Oh, that's the worst part. Okay, come on. Please be as graceful. Okay, there we go. Had to pop those arms in a little bit. I'm going to set him to the side so we can take a look at the accessories. So for swappable hands, we have uh, we have God's gift to mankind. We have Mike holding hands. These are my favorite hands. I immediately put these on the figure. And then we have two punching hands, which is good. See, on my Elite 101, I just put two Mike holding hands. I might put one fisted hand. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. And then, of course, we have the weight belt. Same weight belt, actually, let me... I was about to say I had printing issues, but no, now we're good. That's just the, you know, the design of the belt. And um, we also have the posing hands, the the whoa hands, I guess you could say. And taking a proper look at the figure, I mean, it it's the Elite 101. It has all the great articulation I love about that figure. So I already went over that in the past video, so, I mean, go watch that one. <laughs> That's all I have to say. So we're just going to go straight to the attire. Um, I like that it's inaccurate, because this looks a lot cooler than the attire actually did. So I have the basic 136, which is what this attire is actually supposed to be. And as you can see, it is completely wrong. Just look at that. Look at that terrible difference. They got the they got the blue designs wrong. They, yeah, they got the tights wrong. That, well, the tights are blue here, and they're like gray here. Well, they're like a certain... They're like a faded blue here. But completely inaccurate. And... Yeah, I mean, I, I love the inaccuracy, though, because it's different from this figure, so I can still use this figure, even though this figure is trash, because it has a terrible freaking head scan. Terrible head scan, even though I love that head scan. <laughs> I'm sounding like a mixed bag here, huh? I love the basic 136, because it has the old head, but... Um... And for comparisons, I have the basic 136, of course, and the Elite 101, and um, the difference here... Well, in terms of articulation, there's no difference, but look at that. Elite 101 is a taller figure, somehow. I don't know how they... I would say messed it up. It's not, ter it's not a terrible difference. And plus, it's not like you're going to be using them side by side because they're both the same person. But, um, let's see. The tattoo looks a little different. Oh, yeah, wait a minute. I think Elite 101's tattoo's bigger. Well, I asked to turn the head off, or I asked to turn the paint off. That might be why. Hold on, let me... This Cody head. Bam. Yep. There we go. That's so much better. There we go. That's leagues better. There we go. See? <laughs> so I guess I'm just going to keep popping the head off because I don't think I want to acetone the head off again. Or not the head. Why do I keep saying acetone the head? Acetone the paint off. There's one more thing I want to test though. I did it in the Elite 101 review. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, wow. He doesn't look like a giraffe. That's incredible. Because if you put the head on this figure, it looks like a giraffe. That's crazy. You know, I'm pretty lazy. I might just keep this as the head for a little bit. <laughs> Until I maybe acetone the the tattoo. That's crazy. That's insane. So, um, I love this figure. It's just a repaint at the end of the day. I mean, I love it. I absolutely love it. So, um, I don't know what I gave the last figure review. I think I gave it... I can't... I forgot my own score system. Do I do out of 5 or out of 10? I might have given the 08101 a 4.5 just because the head tattoo. You know what? We're going, we're going out of 5 today. And I'm going to say a 4.9. I got used to the tattoo. All you have to do is acetone it off. And, I mean, this is the Elite 101 head that I already acetoned the, the tattoo off with. So, I mean, it's just... it's. I'm going to give it... I'm going to give it 5 out of 5, 10 out of 10. I love this figure and I love the attire. So, and this has been it for the Cody Rhodes Elite Top Picks Unboxing and Review. And I will see you guys in the next video.